Welcome back to Let's Play Civilization 5 with the Squawker. And yes, everything's interrupting me. When we left off, we were about to invade for India. Um, I'm gonna, what I'm going to do to prevent the world from thinking I'm a total douchebag. I don't know why the sound effects are looping. We're just going to have to live with it today. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to give Gandhi basically a one-term warning. Where I'm just going to be like, bro, I'm going to invade you in a minute. So, you know, don't tell the world I'm a, like a liar or something. But we also have a lot of notifications that we still have barbarians to deal with in West China. I'm just going to move these these two ships into position. Basically, we're, we're pretty much ready to land our invasion force now. We'll contact Gandhi in a minute. Um, I could probably start landing troops now, but I think it's going to be more dramatic if I just land them next turn. Um, right. A trade route has been broken. Ooh, that's not good. What? Where's the trade route been broken? Between Mer Mercia and Beijing. So let's check. Right. Who else has lost trade routes? So Mercia, Tianjin, Damascus, and Mecca have lost trade to the capital, right? And I know who's fucking behind this bloody barbarian to wrecking up my road network now. Well, who can you attack, Nanjing? Don't want, don't attack the workers. I want I want them captured alive. You go there, get into capturing position. Can't take him this turn, but just be an intercept position. Right, you guys go to Beijing and heal up. You guys, let's see. Keep improving the trade network as it is at the minute. Let's see, not notifications, do you want to go away? Oh, Shanglo can attack as well, so let's try and get rid of these. Let's go for the anti-tank gun this time. Oh wow, you actually killed one of them, that's amazing. Um, where's this row of cavalry? Right, Shanghai, try and take them out. Uh, still not doing good enough. And let's see, we've got a city-state message here, and this frigate also wants something to do. Oh yeah, because we've got the mystery guy here, I forgot. Yeah, we'll meet him in a minute, actually, right? So, but let's just quickly see. Belgrado wants rid of Helsinki. I don't know where either of those are, so I don't care. No, oh, no, 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 don't. Oh, God, right. Game. I hate it when this game decides what when I should move to, right? Frigate. Frigate, hello, frigate. Find, find the mystery people. Ooh, we found Korea as well. Ah, uh, Korea. Now I know where you are and where to invade you. The game's frozen, so... Who have we... Whoa! Cool cheering, but I think he's just decided. I think he's just told everyone he's gonna kill me. Yeah, he looks dangerous. He looks like he might kill me. Yeah, but still, we've met the Aztecs. But yeah, um, bye. He he has a face that could kill. Oh, and speaking of Korea, they're now at war with Denmark. So you never know; they might weaken each other for me. England has denounced the last person we haven't met. So once that's Polynesia, Gandhi's industrial now and we've got production. Right. Start scouting the Korean coast. Ooh, what's that? That's an odd looking ship actually. Is that what's Ooh, a turtle ship. Ooh, very interesting. Nice little Korean ship, and there's the city of Hamhung. Sounds like Samsung. I think Korea's stealing my city names. Anyway, let's um let's let's do some production now. Just production of Bursa, you've just finished wars and we are really now starting to get on top of our happiness issues. 15 turns for a theatre, let's do that. Oh, and by the way, da -da 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 -da, when I find it, science, we are working towards nuclear weapons now, just so you know, and they're going to be fun. We've only got 14 more turns to wait before we can start unleashing Armageddon. Right, you guys, recommended you build a trading post, but I want that marsh clearing out first. Right, you guys, I just want you all to sit tight. That's alright, you. Just sit tight. 
you sit tight. You, you're, you guys, you're sitting tight. Right, there we go. Everyone's just now sitting and waiting for the order to invade, which is excellent for me. Right, any more production we need to do. Beijing's finished at public school and is going to start working on infantry. Um, anyone else? Guangzhou has finished a workshop and will now work on a factory. And that should be it. We have to maybe find some more coal soon because my supplies are running a bit thin. I wonder if the Indians have any that I could borrow. Oh, we, oh yeah, we've got to move our northern frigate, haven't we? Right, let's carry on exploring then. Let's um, keep heading, well, heading eastwards now. Oh, there's Belgrado, but I don't know where Helsinki is, so I don't care. I can't remember which city state hates the other now. I'm, I'm not... I'm not what you'd call exactly smart. So, right, you guys go there. And... Right. Next turn, then. Oh, shit, I forgot to denounce India. Oh, well, the invasion can wait one more turn, I guess. Iroquois have denounced the Danish. I guess that's because they get on quite well with the Koreans. Um, Aztecs. I think we have met everyone now. So, yeah. Aztecs have denounced India. All right. I could probably make a worthy ally out of um, out of Montezuma. That it would speed up the invasion of India if I could get if I could fight Gandhi on two fronts. Cause he can't he wouldn't be able to put up with a Chinese invasion and an Aztec invasion. But I haven't done enough reconnaissance into Aztec territories to see if he's strong enough to put up a fight against Gandhi. Old Gandhi just squished it. Among oh hello. Oh, so you want war with the Aztecs now? Um, sorry, but my army is really far away. I don't think it'd be 10 turns. It'd give us enough time to get there. So, yeah, I'm sorry. Sorry, dude. Yeah, another time. Like, Mongolia's like that one friend who somehow, for some reason, never cares how many times you blow him off with, like, arrangements and shit. It's like, oh, just another time, bud. I must be really testing his patience now. I mean, let's just... Oh, losing grasp on Sidon. I don't want that happening. Oh, my gold income is shit now, by the way. Fa thanks to those barbarians. Barely making any. Because with that trade route cut off, that, mo most of my gold production's just gone down the drain. -o. So I basically lost connection with all of Arabia and all of Spain. Not brilliant. I'm going to have to find these holes in the road. Put an end to these bloody barbarians. Right. Let's get through all these notifications then for turn 356. So, ba 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 ba. Shang Lo can attack. Right, keep hitting these anti tank dudes. Right, you're doing okay. Let's see. Nanjing. No, don't hit those. You go capture them. Nice one. That road's been damaged, that's why. Need to repair that road. Never mind. You guys. Um, I want you to get down here and start working on the Tianjin Railroad, if that would be so good of you. you. Let's see what else is going on. Shanghai can attack. Shanghai, you hit these guys. Nice! You took them both out. That's good work. And. Ba -ba 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 -ba. Right, what else? Right, you guys have finished the oil well, so we want nine oil now. Some more oil here, actually. Um, oh, shit, we're losing gold, though. I'll have those guys work on a trading post. Um, I don't want to pay 250 gold to sit on. Don't want to give them 500, because then I'll be broke. Right. Um, da -da -da anything else? Yeah, denouncing, denouncing. Okay, last things last. Diplomacy, Gandhi. Gonna denounce him. I mean, not that many people seem to like the Indians anyway. Discussions. Public. What do you propose? I propose, propose to tell you you're a dickhead. Yep, you are now denounced. Oh, you're not happy. I invade you in one year, Gandhi. You have your warning. So, yep, India has been denounced. That may get other people to maybe be a bit narky with them, so 
Let's just bring up the general diplomacy pol thing. Who is the strongest nation at the minute who isn't me? So we're sitting pretty on a score of 1170. Korea is on nearly 700. So I think Korea is probably the big nasty in the world. Um, I think if we were to go to the victory progress, we can see... Yep, we know everyone now, by the way. So on this planet, we had China, India, Turkey, the Iroquois Nation, Korea, Polynesia, aka Hawaii, um, the Aztecs, slash sort of like Mexico, Denmark, England, Spain, Arabia, and Mongolia. Pretty interesting world we have. But the positioning of everything is a bit weird. Oh well, who am I to judge? Also, one, two, three, four people are missing their capitals and two nations have actually been wiped out as well, so yeah. So, um, yeah. Um, wonder if I could propose an invasion with... Would I be able to propose an invasion with the Aztecs? I'm, I'm actually going to try this. I think it could work. Oh god, why does he do that? you you, you you pose in the weirdest ways, Montezuma. And why do you always have to bring your whole empire with you whenever we talk? Can't hear myself think over all this bloody shouting. Discuss. Otsugi. Shall we declare war against Gandhi? Oh, you don't wanna? Alright, buddy. Um, see you later then. Now, Denmark wouldn't want to invade the Indians. I think, one, they get along quite well, and two, um, Denmark's a bit occupied with Korea. And Actually, I wonder if I could get Hiawatha on my side on this invasion. Because my thinking is, the more people I get helping me with this invasion, the quicker I can take Delhi. Because I'm trying to just lightning take... No, wait, that's... No, 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 that's... Oh, damn it. We've accidentally rung up Kamehameha. Yeah. Yes, I know you don't like me. You never do. Bye. I was just wasting your time. Here, Waffa. Here, Waffa. I'm just going to ring you up here, Waffa. This is a booty call, and you are going to do what my booty tells you to. Right, can you declare... Uh, shall we declare war against Gandhi? Even though... No? All right. That's because you're too busy hating on Suleiman, of course. I don't know why you guys care about Suleiman. He's all the way over uh, on my continent. Unless he's been attacking your shipping route, I don't care. Anyway, next turn we're going to invade the Indians. So let's just quickly do a roundup on stuff. Right, Imperial Coast has finished at harbour, uh, which just boosts its general shippiness. I'm going to have it start working on a destroyer because ironclads are fucking useless. So, uh, yeah. Im Imperial Coast will now be producing destroyers for my destroying needs. Um, any other business we need to take care of? These guys are healing, so yeah. There's only two barbarian units running around the Empire now, so we're nearly on top of this at least. Uh, ooh, Mecha, Mecha, why are you producing science? Um, let's change our production. Let's change you over to... Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. Any happiness buildings I could get you cranking out? I could do, have you do a castle, but that'll take a while. Do a workshop for the minute. Okay. Uh, ba -ba -ba. Yep. Oh, wait, my car. I want you off science as well. You work on a workshop as well. Alright, we need to repair this trade route. Let's just check where the break is here. Um, uh, Shanglo's connected, so the break must be... No, Shanglo will be connected by sea, actually. Guangzhou doesn't have a connection. Nanjing doesn't have a connection. Yeah, this is definitely where the break is in our trade route. Right here, these hills. This is where our trade route's been smashed, and that has actually economically crippled us, which is... Yeah, these barbarians are assholes. Right, any last productions? Uh, Chengdu, you've done a factory and Wow, look at those times now to produce anything always get a factory up folks always get your factories up because I mean look at this I can get I can get these buildings from quickly get a castle up sharpish so for the extra happiness please all right you workers right you'll have finished that railroad so um, 
you go there and just get working on more railroads and anyone else right you workers right um, let's see if you get to where this great general's hanging around and not being useful well, actually you, you soldiers you should be in India get get head over to India now as well as you random great general you you Gaius or Arminus Gaius of course it would be you Gaius you're never in the right time at the right place get moving <sighs> all right anyone else right you guys just sit tight for one more turn. You are fucking... Suleiman really is out to dick me over. Putting his Ginnis Reserve on my tiles. And you guys get to work on more railroads. And is that it? No. Right. You guys, I just want you all just to wait one more turn. And then we should be okay. Next turn then. Uh, oh yeah, our ships have carried on exploring as well. Let's just see if we discovered anything new. We found, right? We found the uh, Korean city of Gwangu. All right, that's um, not bad. Uh, keep going south. Let's see if we. Ooh, nice uncolonized mountain ranges here. Ooh, and ooh, Mongolian vessels might be near. More Mongolian vessels actually. Um, we might be getting near Mongolia. Ooh, but, hang on, more Koreans there. Yeah. Ooh, hang on, what was that down there? Sosmet. Is there another city? Ah, Kuala Lumpur's here. Right, we've nearly f found them. I don't know how they've been communicating with us. I guess it's through, I don't know, some sort of email. You guys keep doing so Oh, new natural wonder. What have we found? The Baringa Crater. Alright, big crater. It's increased happiness. Um, if we were to capture it, we would get two gold and three science per turn. That'd be cool. But yeah. Crater. Big ho fucking hole in the ground. Next turn. Oh, India. India, are you going to declare war on me? Oh, no, you're denouncing me back because we're petty children who love to have petty arguments. You'll pay for this, bitch. Suleiman, you're probably just going to take advantage of his dunnant session to declare war on me. No, you're not. Here, Waffa, you're just going to be here, Waffa, and probably get all arsy about Suleiman because you hate him. Oh wait, you're gonna get you're gonna get knacky with me if I go to war of India. Um, get over it. This is a new heartless squawk you're dealing with here. Who is let's face it, who now wants to take over the world? Because yeah. Oh, and Polynesia has announced Denmark, but their dun dun session of me has expired. Aztecs are taking forever. So get yep, here we are. You're denouncing me for denouncing India, okay, even though you hate India. Even though you're gullible as fuck. I'm guessing he is. Because, to be honest, that's probably true. England. England, to be honest, Eng I think England's the last nation that we don't well, actually know. We just need to find where England and Mongolia is, and we're, and we're set for this world, actually. I just need to take, take a quick drink. Ah, that was a lovely drink. I'm a bit thirsty today. I've been working hard being myself. Oh, wow. See, this is why Mio and Genghis are such massive bros. See, he doesn't like India. You know, Genghis and me, you know, we're, we're bros, you know. We're, we're like, you know, we're, we're, we're close. We're close. You know, we're, we're brothers from another mother. That, that's who we are. Me and, me and Genghis, you know, I mean that time when he invaded China, pfft. well in real life he hadn't invaded me in this game and if he does I'll kill him or wring his little neck, but yeah, Genghis and me, bros for life, or at least until I invade and take his capital, but I'll just be saying, I just need to borrow this dude, you know, you'd let a bro just borrow your capital city, wouldn't you, bro? Anyway, barbarians, I guess they're going to go and fuck everything up. Yes, they are. Right. Um, let's just clear out these barbarians and then start a war. And we've discovered a new encampment. Where is it? That's in a location where I don't give a fuck. Right. Let's get on with this. Why are the barbarian encampments in this day and age as well, though? Um... Right, we've established a new trade route between Imperial Coast and Beijing, thanks to our harbour. Um, 
Shanghai, you can attack. Nice, nice, nice. We've nearly got him done. Uh, Shang Le is the other one that can attack. Right, Shang Le, try and do good this time. You know, you don't get many things right. Just get this thing right. No, you don't. You, you're still shit. And let's just quickly go over world politics again as a recap. Aztecs have denounced me because Montezuma is a gullible fucker. Um, Polynesia no longer denounces me, but he'll do it next turn knowing him. And um, Polynesia has denounced Denmark because Polynesia hates everyone even over a one city nation. You guys are going to do a trading post to raise extra gold. And that trade route of Imperial Coast has started to mend, put our economy on the mend, which is a good thing. Um, and yeah, let's do it. Let's um, go formally declare war on Gandhi. We've got to do this with, you know, some sort of decorum. Uh, let's see, where's Gandhi? Gandhi, 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 Gandhi. You're somewhere on this panel, I know you are. Don't hide from me. Gandhi! You look like a man who's about to surrender to me. And soon you will. War, bitches! War. I've declared war on the most peaceful man in the world. Does it make me a massive bastard for wanting to kill Gandhi? Also, since when was Gandhi king of India? You know... Oh my god, and look at all this war actually. So let's see, um, all this, loads of city states have gone to war. So Almaty, Almaty, Genoa, Sidon, and Budapest are all on my side, which is ironic since Gandhi was really in with Budapest. But you know, money buys alliances. Right, you guys, you will land and capture some workers. Nice one, you guys. Move into land. Nice one. You guys, move into land. You guys, move in for land. Um, I don't know how big M Mumbai's range is in terms of attacking power. So I'm just going to be a bit careful where I land things. You guys, get moving. And you guys also get moving. Um, there we go. You're in trouble now, Gandhi. You're in trouble now. And, of course, all trade deals with Gandhi's are now off. Um, you guys, I've assumed, have finished another railroad. So, get that one sorted with Honolulu. And we will be very well developed in occupied Polynesia. Oh, and you artillery, what are you doing here? You're not being useful, and you infantry, you're not being useful either. Get your asses over to Mumbai now. Come on. No, no time for lazy bones in my infantry. Come on. Come on. You've got a war to fight, son. You've got a war to fight. Get moving. Okay, I think that's all uh, movements in terms of military done, so let's... Get on with this. Right, what work? Are, right, you guys. Um, right, you guys, I'm assuming, are finished for railroad here. So, get moving. And keep expanding it. Um, let's just double check. Any infantry that can respond to barbarians. You guys aren't strong enough. You guys, you're, you're quite far away from the anti-tank guys. But, to be honest, you're the best we've got since shang -Lu. May as well just not even try anymore. Considering how useless it is. Right, you workers. Right, you guys. I want you here and repairing that road. Get to work on it. And... Right, you guys. Um, I want you keeping away from that cavalry. And I want you over here ready to repair things. Right, is that everyone done? Nope. Right, you guys. Um, you guys could start a real connection between um, Zion and everywhere else which would help infantry that I'll get from here move a bit quicker right what's going on here right south exploration fleet you are to carry on exploring like a good soldier let's see Ooh, Kuala Lumpur controls quite a bit of territory here actually most intriguing oh an annoying a Belgrade caravel is in my way that's that's not brilliant. Oh, and look what we found here, actually. We found the polar ice caps. Wow. We, this, must, this must be like the far northern reaches of the world. Very interesting. 
a bit more oil as well. And hello, who's this we found? Looks like we've stumbled across some English territory. This must be that must be the town where Elizabeth is getting her bloody massive navy. You guys, um, you guys can embark via uh, Budapest. That would work for me. And unless anyone else needs orders, I guess it's Gandhi's time to try and react to what I do. So let's see if this goes well or if it becomes a bloody big disaster. Next. No, wait. Someone else need movement? I just heard the noise. Yes, someone does. Okay, workers. Get working on that railroad, please. And you workers. Um, you're building the uh, Tianjin Railroad, so get working. Alright, let's get over to Mumbai and see what Gandhi does. Public declaration from India. We'll check that out in a minute. Right. Actually, it's a good thing he went for the anti-tank guys. That's an, they're making a nice distraction. So, yeah. Kudos to them. Korea. Korea's just going to be Korea, which is... Well, you know, drill. they just hate me. Polynesia. Well, they don't like me. They just, they just seem to hate me a lot. I'll let you know. Yes, you love India. Get over it, Kamehameha, or I'll blow you up. Aztecs, right. Denmark. Denmark gonna do out. Nope. England. Well, I know where you are, England, and I know where your England is. England has denounced the Danes. Alright, alright. Looks like world politics are hotting up a lot here, actually. Um, everyone's denouncing everyone. We've even got a few wars breaking out. I think, I think my presence on this continent is destabilizing everything, to be honest. I like it. Yeah, let's start a few wars. And I can just sweep up and take everything I want with my superior military. It's a good day to be China. A very, very good day. And actually, you know, we are only two turns away from starting World War II, so yeah. This is how it really started, folks. China invaded India and then shit went to shit. True history. Oh, and the Aztecs existed as well, and they just announced everyone they see, because Aztecs. And, the city st and also, there are a lot of annoying city-states who uh, existed in a separate time stream to everyone else, where they did everything in slow motion. Isn't history fun? Well, I just randomly click around this map looking for interesting things to look at. Come on, how long are you going to process this bloody caravel's movements for? It's only a caravel. Come on. That what that lighthouse is being weird. I mean look at it. Turning its beam slowly. I don't trust it. I think it's up to something. Ah, here we go. Barbarians. Barbarians are blowing everything up as usual. Shangla can fire. Annoyingly, that cav row cavalry I think has now moved out of the range of Shanghai. I think it I think it's cottoned on to the fact that, yeah. Right, you infantry. Infantry garrison, you are more than healthy enough now to get moving. So, yeah, finish them. Right, that's nearly all these barbarians taken care of. So, we now we'll start the repair process, and you guys are going to be deployed to India. Uh, what was that declaration from India? India will now no longer protect Budapest since Budapest is at war with them. So, yep. Uh, right, let's do some invading. Right, let's set this up nice and neatly. So, uh, artillery. Let's just check. One tile, two tile, three tile. You'll hit Mumbai from there. So, right. Open fire, please. Let's see how much damage we do. Ooh, four damage. Right, we've kicked this one off nicely. Okay, cavalry. How would you do against those pikemen? It'll be about even. Um, I'm going to have you guys move here. Um, you're going to be on exploration duties. See if we can discover a little bit more about our Indian hosts. Your infantry will take this hill. Anti-tank infantry. Anti-tank gun. Let's see. What could we have you do? Uh, you're going to suck at any, everything you do. So I'm going to have you just move actual infantry um, since you're not ranged I want you on the hill so you can threaten those crossbow men other infantry you're gonna move in here and attack Mumbai 
Ooh, they took a little bit of a beating, but we've, we've pushed Mumbai into a yellow, so that keeps me very happy. Other artillery, when you're ready. When you're ready, right, you guys, disembark. And you're out of moves, but we'll, I'll find something for you to do. I'm going to probably deposit you on us horses. We're probably going to go next Mumbai, but due to happiness issues, I will be basically... I'm basically going to destroy any minor cities that I will have no use for. Like if they won't have, if I have low production, they're not going to be much use to me because I, I need to get reinforcements streaming out really quickly. As for Valencia, you're going to start a workshop now. And right, Southern Frigate, um, go here. Let's see what we can find. Looks, looks like we found a southern tip of a continent. Um, ooh, and another city state actually. I wonder who I wonder who these guys are. They're purp well they're pinky purple. Monaco. They are cultured according to that readout, so yeah. Nice little fifteen gold from them. Um don't really have any use for Monaco, so I'll just leave them be. Um right, let's anyone else need orders? Of course our northern frigate, right. Gathering tell on England's naval operations because Let's face it, England has a huge navy, and we found Nottingham. And as an Englishman, I can tell you, Nottingham does not exist on a sturdy shithole. But then again, I've never been to Nottingham, so I could be completely wrong. And nothing else. Maybe Nottingham controls all this territory, which to be honest is bloody unlikely. Right, anyone else? Right, you guys, you've built that railroad, I'm assuming, so just get moving south and keep building. You workers, you built up that trading post. Start building railroads out of car border so we can meet everyone. You workers, go to Budapest where you're going to be safe for now. And, ah, uh, you know you've picked a bad ally actually when they're still training warriors. Oopsies. Oh well, anyone else need orders? Or, uh, no, right, next turn, right, turn 359. Let's do it. See what India gets up to this turn. Come on, can we go to the next turn? Oh, someone, someone's AI messed up. Yep. Right, artillery, artillery. What are you doing? You, you are to get to, you are to get your bum over to Mumbai now. Want it blowing up? Okay, if that's everyone. Is that everyone? Is that everyone? Is that everyone? Probably not, and we're still losing gold, which does not make me happy. Next turn, please. India. What's India going to do? Still going for the anti-tank artillery. That's good. Anti right, that's our distraction unit down. Uh, see, this is the only annoying thing about upgrading to gunpowder. You lose range. That's a bit annoying. Oh, dear. Oh dear, they're moving in more artillery actually. Oh well, if we can move these infantry here, they should be able to take out them. Oh, hello. You have a serious matter to, to discuss. Your relationship with Mongolia has broken down. And you need... And I need you to... You are asking me to denounce my bro for life. You are... Are, are, you, are you mad, Hiawatha? Um, let's see. Well, remember when I asked you to go to war with India and you said no? Yeah. Screw you. Oh, so I'm an ally with... Oh, so you're going to denounce me just because I have friends. You know what you are, Hiawatha? You're a douchebag. You're next on the invasion list, buddy. Right. Uh, let's... Let's see, what we, what do we know about the Iroquois so far? We know they've got a lot of naval cities and they have one island. So there's Osinaka, Gen Genesee River. So their capital, which I believe is called Kaganawaha. Um, well, I assume it's called Kaganawaha. It might have changed in Civilization V. It it's going to be somewhere here. Mongolia has announced Denmark and the Iroquois. See, Mo Mongolia's on my side, bitch. You know what, I'm gonna you know what, next turn I'm denouncing the Iroquois. You know what, fuck them. I, I thought we had something here, Waffa, but it turns out we just don't. Just turns out you're an asshole. 
Right, city states, come on, or I'm going to denounce all of you as well. I'm just going to go on a big denouncing spree. Um, let's talk about something else, actually. Um, yesterday, no, actually, no, the day before yesterday, or the day I recorded this, um, I finished the Advanced Warfare campaign, and I'm going to say it now, Advanced Warfare had a absolutely amazing campaign. The graphics were absolutely top-notch, and I don't regret getting an Xbox One because it was it, a good story, nearly on level with Call of Duty 4, actually, or even better. Um, I mean, it had a good overarching plot, a lot of good gameplay mechanics, actually. It didn't fall into the trap of, like, toy boxing, where you'd get one special thing per level. Some stuff, like, carried over, which I really liked. And, yeah. Okay, let's see. Let's get on with this. Let's go on with the final turn of the episode. A uh, few notifications. shang -Lo. you can attack. Try and finish him this time. Still doing a bad job. You only did one damage. Right, you guys, try and find out where my bro lives. We've met Warsaw. And England was probably protecting him. So, yeah, don't care. What, ca what is Warsaw? Cultural. Alright, well, I'd, I have no interest in Warsaw then. Looks like all the cultural guys just hang out here. Yeah, it's, it's the culture corner, everyone. It's the culture corner. Yeah. Right, anyway, we've got a promotion to do. Right, uh, a new Nanjing anti-tank gun um, will be given shock. Since a lot of in India seems to be mostly open terrain, so yeah. Um, I have no idea why I had Nanjing building one of these, though, because since I don't really plan to use them in my... Military, and my military advisor is actually telling me a factory should be set up here, and yeah, I'll do what he says this time. Um, as for your second promotion, get shock too. Um, anything else? Yes, anti tank gun. Mongolia denounced Denmark, Mongolia denounced Iroquois, Iroquois denounced me, and my anti tank gun was destroyed. Let's quickly go to diplomacy. Here, Waffer. Oh, yeah, bullshit, he's friendly. Right. Here, Waffer. Since you denounced me for being a twat, I oh, don't act friendly with me. Discuss. You are. Actually, no. I'll... Right. I'll... I'm going to give you one chance to be my friend. One chance. Wants to do it? Oh, no. Alright. Yeah. You are denounced. Bitch. Right. Goodbye. Don't like you. Just do not like you. Um, anything else? Well, let's carry on with our invasion of Mumbai, actually. All right, so let's start off with artillery strikes. So artillery, when you are ready and to be selected. Right, bombard Mumbai, which has recovered a little bit of health, but not enough to be an, an annoyance. Did six damage. Okay. Um... Where's my other artillery? It's here. Right, other artillery. If I could select you, I want you here. That'll take up your moves. You guys, take out these pike men. Come on, come on, come on. You outclass them. Nice job, lads. Right, you're in a place to threaten those pike men. Um, you infantry, you could... You're going to make mince me out of these guys to so go for it. Come on. Come on. This shouldn't be hard. Why are you letting him perk you to death? Right, so you, since you guys probably ran out of ammo or something, you, you just lost a bunch of your comrades. You guys go for another attack. Come on. Yes, we pushed Mumbai into the red. Right. Sadly, we won't take Mumbai this episode, but we'll have it. Probably on the first turn of next episode, so that'll be good. You mop up that cat. You mop up those pike men. No. Oh my god. Don't let him. Really. Right, so we lost two cavalry units thanks to them not shooting the enemy. Um, heal up. And that should be it in, in on the Indian battle theatre thing. Shanghai, what can I have you do today? There's no more happiness buildings left for you, unless it doesn't opera house. No, opera houses are for culture. Alright. Start working on our first tank. 
I know they're bad against cities, but we're going to phase out cavalry for these guys, because I doubt pikemen can kill them. Right, anyone else who isn't Shanghai? Uh, oh, wait, this cavalry still has moves left, does it? Uh, didn't I tell you guys to heal, or... Oh, I'll just bet you move again. Right, move here. You can be even do distraction. Right, more production. Shanghai, I've just told you to build a tank. Bloody do it. Um, anyone else want production? Or are you just all trying to waste my time? You guys. Infantry. Infantry. Will you be selected today? Nope, it's worker. What's my attention more? Okay. Go here and continue working on the railroad. When you want to, of course, since you guys do not like taking following orders. You guys. I want you here. And where is my other artillery? No, no, no. Go away, workers. For God's sakes. Such attention whores. Army comes first. Army comes first now. You guys just theoretically move here. And let's choose any more production. Honolulu has now finished a workshop. Uh, anything a workboat can do here doesn't look like it. Um, so let's see what could we ha else could we have you build? Um, I'll get your paper maker up first, actually, just for the extra science and a ne nice little bit of ca cash input. You guys rebuild the railroad. Once this railroad's rebuilt, our gold problems should be solved. As for you guys, right, actually, I'm going to make this anti-tank gun the um, garrison of the city, since I don't have much use for them on the front line. Um, also, they'll push up happiness a little bit more. Uh, right, you workers, you've cleared up that swamp, I'm assuming, so get working on a trading post. You guys get working on a railroad. You guys go here and work on more railroads in this not very green farm, but yeah. To be honest, I don't trust you workers because you're bloody lit. No, wait, you didn't even finish the farm, did you? Right, get finishing the farm. <coughs> you guys go to sleep. <coughs> I'm getting a cough, but we're pretty much at the end of the episode. Our Istanbul workers done, so right. You now have a long and arduous task of repairing Istanbul. And no, go away, go away. Istanbul, you can now start producing something new. Uh, start off with a circus and if that is everything nope <coughs> Ankara do your s not having you do a monument so you can do do a granary just for the extra growth and yep that should be it so let's see what India does and oh wait we got we haven't done our frigates this turn haven't we right frigates oh we found York Hey, we found York! That's where I live! Except York isn't on the coast, so this is bullshit. But who's that? Who's that? A great someone. It's a nice car. Must be a Louis Armstrong. Great artist. Okay. Found Louis Armstrong, everyone. Um, but yeah, that's my, that's my home city there. And, oh my god, a very big... A very big navy, a lot of military units, and a build-up of Mongolian infantry, actually. What if these guys were at war? These, Mon these Mongols get around. Anyone else need orders then before we wrap up? And yes, by the way, World War One has started, because let's face it, we've invaded India. And everyone is getting really nasty, so we're, it'll be 1940 next episode, so yeah. But anyone else need turn? No, right. Let's see what India does. Let's see. Let's see how they set the stage for the next episode. Well, they did it by killing my infantry. Well done, you bastards. Well, fucking done. Just but Mumbai is fucked anyway, so I don't care. Uh, these bloody cannons are wrecking everything. No. Uh, we're down two infantry platoons, which is not good news for me. These cavalry sh should be able to move in and wipe out the cannons for So let us let let us hope that we recover from this little stumbling block next episode. England, you're taking a while. Are you going to... Are you, is it, are you just going to irritate me now? 
Oh, right, so I've, I've been outcast by my own country. Oh, well, I never like living here anyway. <sighs> Jesus Christ, Every no one likes me anymore. I guess, I guess England loved Gandhi as well, I'm assuming. Mongolia, how are you doing, my bro? Do we have a joint declaration of friendship at the minute? I'll have to check that next episode. I think we do have one with him, though. Because, you know, Mongolia's cool. I think Mongolia must be at war with England because they were always, you know... I mean, like, Mon Genghis was always asking me if I wanted to declare war on the English, so... Yeah, there must be a war going on down here. But, yeah. I've discovered quite a bit of this continent as well. You know what? It looks a bit like France for some reason. Like, we've got Normandy. We've got... Calais here, yeah. And there's like the French Riviera where all the cultural cities are. Yeah, we've just found a d disembodied France next to my weird looking continent, which I'm just gonna call China Lagoon. Yep. City states, come on, come on, come on. Chop, chop, chop. Let's wrap this episode up, right? Barbarians, finish off fucking everything up. And, uh, oh, and two English naval ships have moved into my waters, which I don't like. And we've got a social policy, which we'll be doing next episode. So, next time on Civilization 5, social policies. Recovering from the little stumbling block in our invasion of Mumbai and hopefully taking it as well. And everyone denounces me because no one likes me anymore. So, yep, yeah, I think a world war is about to happen because this world is becoming a powder keg. So, until then, goodbye everyone.